Have you ever wandered into the depths of a mysterious forest, wondering about the secrets hidden within? I invite you to subscribe to our channel and like this video as we delve into the thrilling world of the Watchers. Now streaming on Max. This film is the brainchild of Ishana Knight Shyamalan, an emerging filmmaker stepping into the spotlight with her debut feature. Based on A.M. Shine's captivating novel, The Watchers presents a scene haunting mystery, brimming with unexpected twists, mirroring the enigmatic style of her father in Night Shyamalan, who serves as producer. Imagine a young American artist, Mina, portrayed skillfully by Dakota Fanning, finding herself lost in the lush yet eerie woodlands of Ireland. Amidst the trees, she encounters an elderly a woman in a hidden sanctuary known as the Coop. This refuge, however, is shadowed by a sinister presence. Its occupants are being watched by unseen eyes through a reflective barrier. The stakes are high as any attempt to step outside the confines of the Coop could lead to dire consequences. As Mina grapples with her situation, she crafts a daring plan to outsmart her mysterious captors. With its surprising conclusion, the watches may evoke memories reminiscent of Ishana's father's earlier works. Uh, joining Fanning in the cast are uh, talented actors like Georgina Campbell, Owen Foray, Oliver Finnegan, and Alistair Brammer. Uh, despite some critics being less than kind, the film's cast receives notable praise. Uh, Fanning shines as a leading lady, reminding us of her exceptional skills displayed in serious roles on television. Uh, critically, The Watchers has received a mixed bag of reviews currently sitting at a 32% rating on Rotten Tomatoes. While some argue that it treads familiar terrain within horror, others, like Sarah Michelle Federer's from Movie Freak, highlight the unnerving presence of the film's supernatural elements. With the initially launched in the busy summer season, The Watchers struggled at the box office, pulling in $19 million domestically against a $30 million production budget. In a blockbuster climate to those numbers pale in comparison to giant releases, leaving this film trailing behind. Uh, despite the criticisms, the film's dark atmosphere and surprising twists uh, deserve your attention. Uh, with an audience score of 52%, it might not be a legendary thriller, uh, but it certainly holds its own in the modern horror landscape. Modern, and as you consider whether to watch, here's a light-hearted thought, uh, why did the ghost go to the party? Because uh, he heard it was going to be a hauntingly good time. He, uh, he... Uh, with that said, thanks for watching. And until next time.